what I have here is a loaded cursor. It's currently loaded with a Word document that's around 50 pages. Most people see that and they think, I have to place it. And if they have something that's not quite ready for placement, maybe this is the wrong page, maybe they haven't chosen the right layer yet, maybe the margins are wrong, they think, ah, I have to stop this. And then they hit escape to clear the little cursor, and then they go and they make their change, and then they go back to file, place, or hit control D or command D, and get the file again. You don't have to do any of that. There's a lot that you can do with a loaded cursor sitting there, waiting. This is, to use a baseball metaphor, this is content that's on deck waiting to come up to plate. It isn't content that must play right now. It's content that can stand there and wait in the on deck box until it's time to take the plate. You don't have to place it right now. You can do other things. Let's say I need to go to a different page. Oh, you know what? I don't have a different page. I'm going to add some pages here. Page three is what are, where I want to start this. Look at that. I made pages and I still have a loaded cursor. Maybe I don't have the right master page. Let me create a new master. And I'll call that body copy. And maybe I'll change the prefix to bod. And maybe I'll change the size to half a letter page. And hit OK. Now maybe I'll add some new pages based on that master page. And go down there. My cursor is still loaded. I can go to my layers panel. I can choose layers. I can make new layers. I can name the layers. I can choose a lot of menu commands. Maybe I need to change the margins on this. Let's see, we'll go like that. All right. Uh, maybe I have to switch to a different document and check something. I come back, I still have a loaded cursor. Maybe I need to zoom in on this page. As long as I don't change a tool, I'll still have that loaded cursor. So I can't go and choose the zoom tool, but I can use the keyboard shortcuts. I can use command option zero to fit the whole page. Control alt zero on Windows. I can use command or control plus or minus to zoom in. I can even hold the space bar to temporarily get to the hand tool and move around on the page. And then once I let it go, I still have a loaded cursor ready to place my content once the inning's over and it's time to come up to bat again. You don't have to place things right away. You can do stuff before placing them.